Hello everyone and welcome to today's video where we are going to talk about social media marketing. So this is a form of digital marketing where you market your products or a brand of a company using social media platforms such as Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, YouTube and TikTok. Okay, so you create content in the form of images, text and videos then you use it to create a social media post that you post on your social media then this post or the content you are creating aims to either educate or entertain or or simply build up the relationship then with the time for example if you are a company that deals with construction or you sell cement you are writing articles about construction and for someone who is interested in construction they read about the articles they become interested so when they want to finally start constructing they will buy cement from your company because you've earned their trust okay so one important thing that you need to note when you are you are marketing on social media is the use of hashtags because hashtags enable you to tell people what what your post is all about for example if i do a post if i write a post then at the end of the post i write hashtag digital marketing whoever like i allow the social media platform for example the software that runs facebook for example to know that i've written about digital marketing so they will display it in front of people who are interested in in digital marketing for example then one important thing you need to note when you are doing social media marketing is that you need to encourage engagement you need to come up with posts that will encourage engagement for example ask a question for example if you are a musician and you've released an album ask people which of your songs they like the the most and things like that okay so there are two ways to market on social media the first one is organic where you are writing blog posts and you want to build up a a following over a long period of time but you can also do it using ads where you write you you come up with ads then you pay facebook for example or instagram you pay it to display the ad in front of relevant people who might be interested in what you are creating okay then another important thing you need to note when you are doing social media is that you need to engage with your followers for example if you ask a question and people reply you can go through the comments and note what they are doing and you can reply to a few to show that you are interested in their engagements okay then there are different forms of social media the first one is known as content marketing that is mainly if you are targeting to create a social media following organically then you can also create ads or you can do advertising or sponsorship where you are paying money to the social media platform to display your ad in front of relevant people then you can also do what is known as influencer marketing where you want to find people who are relevant who have a huge following on social media then you pay them to display your products on their pages and in so doing you you are able to attract people to your product then you can also contribute to forums for example if you are an architect you go to you establish a social media platform then you contribute to construction forums and in so doing you are able to network with other people who are doing the same thing that you you are okay so the difference between paid and organic marketing on social media is that with paid you are able to reach 
more customers with organic you'll need to come up with a strategy over a long period of time a very good social media strategy over a long period of time before you can get access to the same amount of customers that you can get using paid over a short period of time so ideally you want to go with paid advertising depending on your business okay then another important thing you need to note is that there are social media tools that can enable you to easily manage social media to run social media pages for example if you have you have you want to establish channels on different social media platforms is very hard so you will need social media tools for example one that allows you to just generate one post then you post it to all the five or six or seven platforms for example you just write one post and you post it to instagram facebook twitter and linkedin at the same time so there are social media tools that help you with with that okay so now let's quickly look at some of the social media platforms the first one is facebook you can market on facebook but it's to market on facebook organically is very hard so if you want to market on on facebook ideally you want to do that using ads okay then we have instagram instagram is best for people who are in industries such as modeling and music okay so it's easier to to market on instagram then it's the best best platform to use if you want to do influencer marketing if you want to find any influencer ideally you want somebody who is on instagram then for example if you are in music and you're looking for influencer you can look for people who are on instagram and tiktok okay then you also have youtube which is used for videos and ads though in the recent times it's it's been modified to also allow you to make a post okay so it's not just videos anymore then we have linkedin which you use if you want to target professionals or business people then the last one i'm going to mention here is tiktok which is emerging and it's used especially for people who are in industries such as music okay or if you have a video a funny video or things like that so it's one of the most emerging one of the emerging platforms that is used by a lot of people these days as i summarize let's talk about having a coming up with a social media strategy you want to get started with social media so the first thing you do is you create a goal what you want to do on social media for example i want to have 10000 or more followers on twitter the target is 10000 so how am i going to get there for example i'll post three times a day i'll post at this time and so forth so you come up with things like that then you start coming you start coming up with content and posting then you review your content from time to time to identify things that you need to do better so that's all for social media marketing see you in the next video as we continue to talk about digital marketing